Coach, you uh, head in Saturday, uh, two and one, and you face Central State. Talk about the preparation and what it's going to take to be a, such a team like Central State. I tell you, we need to prepare for Central State just like we would if we were playing for a league championship this coming Saturday. We cannot take any game lightly, and especially a Central State team that has a lot of talent, and they have uh, all they have to do is get more consistent. We have to be able to uh, continue to move the ball offensively like we did the second half against Maris. And defensively, we got to keep making plays, interceptions, fumble recoveries. If we do that on Saturday, it'll be a good day for the Flyers. Um, Central State, Central State's the team we've been playing for a little while. Uh, we played them last year, so that gives us a good idea. Usually, what they're going to do this year, you know, uh, have some film on them. We prepare for them like any other team. Uh, we're going to treat like any other team, and uh, we're going to be prepared for Saturday. Uh, could you just talk about the environment and how you think that will play a part into the game? I think that's going to be a big part of the game, They're uh, being their first home game. They've been on the road for three weeks now, so that will add a little emotional fire to the players, to their school. There will be a big crowd there. All that hostile uh, uh, environment for the Flyers to play in is going to be an advantage for Central State and something that we have to overcome. Yeah, you know, as far as I've been here, we've never played at Central State, so it'll be interesting to go up there. They have a new field. I'm sure they'll have a big crowd that's excited. I think we're the first home game for this season for them. So, uh, you know, we're excited to get up there and, uh, and, and play on their new field in front, of, in front of a good crowd. We're not too far from home, and um, all of our, our pregame away routine is, is kept the same. Coach Chamberlain does a good job of making sure we stay in a good routine, so um, we're definitely ready for Saturday. Um, you talk about the excitement. Let's just talk about the excitement personally with uh, you getting back on the field and talk about the journey uh, it's been to get back out there and the feeling it was to get out there last weekend as well and, you know, make a couple plays and lead the team in tackles. Hey, you know, um, it's been, I think, two close to two years since uh, from injuries that, that I've played in a game. Um, you know, and you go through spring practice and you go through the summer and you're working out with the guys. And that's all great, and practice is great. But you know, you play so you can play in the games and get that feeling of excitement. And, and it was a great feeling to be back out there. You know, I almost forget, forgot what it felt like to be out there with with the guys that, that you're working so hard with in the spring and the summer. So, um, you know, I really can't describe how much fun it was Saturday to be out there playing. Um, Ask the players this: Is there any message that you try to get through to them this week as they prepare for Saturday? What I try to get through to the players is the idea, again, that we're preparing for this game just like any other important game to us. Our whole goal is, is that anybody that we play, league opponent, non-conference, team that's not uh, record-wise doing real well right now, we want to show them the same kind of treatment each and every week.